Hello everyone, in this video I will show you the cheap and best method to keep your filament dry using this white silica gel. In this video I will also say why I choose this white silica gel instead of blue and orange indicating silica gel. I brought this white silica gel from Amazon India. It is a 250 gram silica gel. It comes with multi-layer packing to prevent it from getting moisturized. The reason why I choose this white silica gel is because the indicating silica gel like the blue and orange contains the cobalt chloride and methyl violet. Both are toxic materials. So I go on with this white silica gel. Now let's print some container for this silica gels. I will provide the STL file link in the video description. There are multiple sizes of these containers are available. You can choose the one that fits for you. Now let's fill these containers with these silica gels. Make sure to keep these remaining silica gels in an airtight container. I am using this airtight zip bags to keep my filament safe from the external moistures. Now keep the silica gel container inside the bag and zip it. Make sure it is airtight. Now the filament is safe from the moistures. Since it is a white silica gel, you may be wondering how to identify when it has to be replaced. When it is dry, it looks glossy and shiny. When it absorbs the moisture content, it doesn't look shiny or glossy. From that itself, you can easily identify. You can see here there are some fungus in, in my table drawer, which could also affect the components in my drawer. You can also use this silica gel to keep your electronic components and camera safe from the fungus and moisture content. When you buy a filament, it will come with these silica gel brackets. Do not throw this away. You can dry this and reuse it. In my next video, I will show you how to dry these silica gels easily in a simple way and reuse it. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for my next video.